Hey guys, it's Mary Ellen. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, thanks for stopping by. I'm going to be planning in my Skinny Classic Fitness Planner today. So if you'd like to see that, stay tuned. So I'm really hoping to get this done pretty quickly because I've got a lot going on. I've got a lot going on and a lot of things to do. And I don't want to sit here all day. I got stuff on my desk. I don't want to sit here all day in my planner. Um, so I'm just going to try to do this really quickly. I, You know, I've said that before and it does not work when I say that usually. But I'm going to be using the gardening sticker books today. I hardly ever pick these up just because it's not really like my favorite book or books. And also because I never did get my garden going this year, I will be honest, it is full of weeds now, very, very tall weeds. It's very bad, but maybe next year. Um, but I'm not gonna be using like vegetable stickers or anything. I'm gonna be using plants because I saw these plants and I love plant spreads. I don't know about you. I, I don't know if you've noticed that I do those a lot um, because they're just so cute. I just love, there's something about plant stickers that really appeal to me. So I'm going to use them and I'm going to keep using them because I like them. All right. The first thing I'm going to do is, oh, and by the way, I already covered up the middle here because you can't see on this one because it's, it was like polka dot in different colors and it wasn't really going to match my plant theme. And I'm also gonna cover up that little notes there. Okay, so I thought of something else to put on here and that is uh, in this um, big Mambi stick. It's like the Squaw Girls Mambi sticks. I saw this right here. It just says, and breathe. So why don't I, oh, maybe I should overlap it with something. Maybe I should overlap it with plants or something. Let's see. because it's important to just take a breath and you can get through anything if you just breathe and just do your best. So I'm gonna put that there as a reminder to myself because I've been a little stressed and overwhelmed lately. I know that that's, yeah, the E looks weird. but I'm gonna leave it because I'm just gonna breathe. <laughs> I'm gonna breathe and relax and leave it and embrace imperfection. All right, and breathe. Uh, yeah, I've been overwhelmed lately, so gotta get back to basics. Okay, I'm gonna use plants. Like I said, let's put some plants down. Uh, my goal in this video is to show you that not everything has to be super complicated and difficult when you're doing these spreads, especially in the Skinny Classic, because I feel like the Skinny Classic is actually really easy to plan in, and I didn't realize that. Oh, there's an ant on there. Great. And it's a dead ant. How did that get there? I had ant problems. Um, I had ant problems and I still kind of have ant problems <laughs> over the past few weeks. It's been bad. That's a whole other story. Um, as I was saying, it doesn't have to be hard to plan in these. Just be, you know, just stick your stickers down. Nothing has to be super complicated. I know sometimes I tend to make it complicated and I hope that doesn't stress you out when you go to, to do your plans in your own planner, but um, hopefully it doesn't. I'm just gonna put this here. Now I feel like this should have gone on that side, but I'm just gonna breathe, relax, take it easy and live with it. Okay, I could even leave this like that. How cute is it? It is cute. It's a cute spread. 
Um, let me just look in this book. I don't know if I'm going to be using any from this book. For my Skinny Classic, it's a fitness planner. So I need a block, like a box on each day for my workouts. I kind of like those colors. Let me see what else is in this one. So like I said, I need a box on each day for my workouts because I do morning meltdown and I just want to write in what the workout is of the day. I think I'm going to use these. And some of them say get it done, some say remember. Let's use these ones. I'm okay with it saying like today or like even remember is okay. Let's just throw some down. Oh, I wanna, I think I want to put lines in this time because I really enjoyed the look of the lines. So let's get Happy Planner checklist stencil and we'll see what we can do here i've got piles look at this piles and piles of sticker books next to my filming area which is not a good idea um i think all right let me just add in some of these and we'll see what what we can come up with here Okay, so what I did here was I switched the plants. I did kind of like the look of that plant over there, but I wanted to do alternate lines and it wasn't, the line situation wasn't working out for me, so I just switched the sticker. And that's all right to do. I could, now that I'm looking at it, I could have moved them over a little bit more. Um, although also now that I'm looking at it, I don't know where I'm gonna put those uh, those box stickers that's an issue well let's see what we can do okay so first things first oh man yeah that's gonna be it's gonna be tricky I think we need to cut this down let me cut it down and only use and like take off the get it done part because I do like these colors so let me see if I just make it like a little box sticker here and then it's okay if I overlap the plant a little bit so let's do that not the best but it'll do and then let's do a green so I'm just going to take a moment and put a bunch of these down Okay, I think that's really cute. Again, you know, I did cover up some of the plants, which bothers me a little bit, but if I but if I overlap the plants on top of here, I would not have room to write, and writing's more important than design for me. So that's gonna work for me. Um, I thought up here, maybe I will put a little plant, so I'm gonna take it out of this one, this darker one, because the plants on this page are lighter, and then like, this whole page seems darker with the darker browns and the darker green up there so i thought i'd add a little bit of darker up here and just a little design at the top here i don't want that stem to, to show up so i'm gonna reposition this all right Oops, so that just adds a little something, I think, to the top of the page. 
So I really like it. Now I'm wondering if I should put something up here too. What if I put snow? I feel like if I do, there's gonna to be too much green next to green. I think I'm okay with it just on this side of the page. So I think it's really classy and pretty and yeah, I like it. Let me know in the comments what you think. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, hey, what are you waiting for? Click that subscribe button. I'd appreciate it so much and the notification bell so you don't miss any videos. And um, well, let me put it back in my planner. I'll show you what it looks like in the planner because this one has rainbow disc. Here's what it'll look like. Like I'd rather have gold or something, but it's actually kind of cute on the rainbow. It's not bad. All right, I hope you guys have a great day, a wonderful week, and stay tuned for Doodle of the Day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.